بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على سيد الأنبياء والمرسلين يا ربنا يا ربنا يا أرحم الراحمين يا أرحم الراحمين يا أرحم الراحمين يا رب العالمين يا رب العالمين once again another here another شبه براد Ya Rabbil Alameen, please make this Shabay Barat unlike any other Shabay Barat that we've had in the past. Ya Allah, make our lives from this second, from this moment onwards, make, it, make our lives better than they were before we came here. Ya Allah, our Iman, please elevate our Iman to a different level. Ya Allah, our sincerity, Mawla Kareem, grant His sincerity, elevate our sincerity to a higher level. Ya Rabbil Alameen, please purify our hearts. Please clean and soften our hearts. Ya Allah, these rusty hearts that have become stronger than any rock, are harder than any rock on the planet. Ya Rabbil Alameen, please penetrate our hearts with the light of your zikr, with the light of your beloved Mahbub, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Ya Rabbil Alameen, with the light of the Qur'an. Ya Allah, we, we stood here, we sat here in this Qabristan, surrounded by dead bodies, surrounded by people who've died. Some of them we knew. Ya Allah, some are children, not, not all of them are old. Some are younger than us. Some are children, some are people that we grew up with. Ya Rabbil Alameen, people... Lying in these graves, many of them more talented than us, who had brighter futures than us. Ya Rabbil Alameen, people who, there are people lying in these graves who thought that uh, their families and their friends would not be able to survive without them. People would miss them. But Ya Allah, they've been forgotten. Many have been forgotten. We will be forgotten as well. Ya Rabbil Alameen. Please grant us the tawfiq to enlighten our hearts. Be serious about the purpose of our existence. Amen. Ya Allah, make us realize and understand and appreciate the purpose of our existence. Amen. Ya Rabbul Alameen, may our zikr, may our attending this mehfil not just be a formality. May our namazes not just be formal namazes, just a routine. Ya Allah, may our namazes be namazes that elevate us to different levels of our iman. Amen. Not just routine namaz, not just routine coming to the masjid on a jummah. Ya Allah, not just routine listening to speeches just for the sake of giving our hazri. Ya Rabbul Alameen, we hear stories of these saints and their, their fear, their taqwa, their attitudes centuries ago. And it seems so distant from our experiences, from our lifestyles. But Ya Allah, give us those experiences as well. Ya Allah, we're living in material, we're living in societies and cultures with our, which are governed and are based on materialism. Ya Allah, we've all be become materialistic as well. Ya Allah, ya Allah, make us people of spirituality. Ya Allah, make us see things that we, we can't. Ya Allah, you are the only one who can give us vision and insight. Ya Allah, give us vision and insight to see things as they are. Ya Rabbul Alameen, expand our, our vision, our hearts. Ya Rabbul Alameen, grant us the tawfiq to see the difference between right and wrong. Ya Allah, we have no common sense, give us common sense. Ya Ilah al Alameen. Give us the tawfiq to understand who we should be supporting, who we should not be supporting. Amen. Ya Allah, the difference between good and bad, Ya Allah, it's blurred. The line Allah. between haq and batil, between sin and good deeds is so blurred today, Ya Allah. We can't see the difference, it's confusing, we're confused. Ya Allah, we can't even admit we're confused. We act as though we're smart and we understand every single bit of thing. Ya Allah, but we're confused. Ya Allah, you know we're confused. You know we're, we're, we're walking in the opposite direction that we should be striving in. Mawla Kareem, please turn our directions. Ya Allah, fix our directions for us. Ya Allah, give us good leaders. Give us good spiritual leaders. Ya Allah, give us good leaders. Leaders of all sorts, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, even leadership, deen, our masajid. Give us ikhlas in our masajid as well. Ya ilaha al alameen, brothers who are sick, who have sick relatives, whether they are physical illnesses, spiritual illnesses, or psychological illnesses, give them shifa. Amen. Ya ilaha al alameen, cancer patients, stroke patients, brothers and sisters who are depressed, Ya Allah, give them shifa. Amen. Ya Allah, brothers who have disabled children, give them shifa. Amen. Ya ilaha al alameen, make earning a halal sustenance easy for us. Amen. Ya Allah, we know sometimes we're presented with opportunities to earn quick money by, by lying or by doing something haram. But give us the tawfiq to be patient. <coughs> give us the tawfiq to be patient and resist the temptation to earn haram quick money. Ya Allah, make earning halal sustenance easy for us. Amen. Ya Allah, the difficulties that we encounter in our pursuit for halal 
and a good livelihood give us the tawfiq to be strong and patient in the face of those difficulties ya allah make us patient make us grateful make us appreciate the blessings that you bestow upon us ya allah we usually only appreciate things after we've lost them ya allah make us appreciate things before we lose them ya allah the sihat the afiyat the health the peace that you give us Give the tawfiq to appreciate it and use it to serve you. Amen. Ya Allah, may we not use these blessings of health and sihat and mal to disobey. Amen. Ya Allah, strengthen our iman. Amen. We don't know whose du'as are going to be accepted. Ya Allah, we don't know whose du'as are going to be accepted today. Mawla Kareem, please accept our du'as for the sake of your beloved Habib sallallahu alayhi wa May we not only claim to love your holy prophet, may we act. Ya Allah, may our actions show sincerity and love for your beloved Mahbub sallallahu alayhi wa Wherever Muslims are being tortured or oppressed throughout the world, especially your brothers and sisters in Kashmir, in Palestine, give them freedom, give them peace, give them safety, give them security. Shower your, pour your divine assistance upon them. Ya Allah, any conspiracies against Muslims and against Islam, Ya Allah, make all those conspiracies fail. Ya Allah, guide these zalimeen. Ya Allah, save the Muslims from zulm, Amen. from kufr, from Amen. oppression. Amen. Ya Rabbul Alameen. Ya Allah, give us all, all the whole ummah of your Habib alayhi salam unity. Allah. Ya Allah, we're asleep. Allah. We think we're awake. We think we're intelligent. We think we're civilized. Ya Allah, ya. Kasam, we're not civilized. We're not awake. We're asleep. Ya Allah, we need... Ya Allah, no one can awaken us if you do not awaken us. Ya Allah, you are the one to make us civilized. Ya Allah, free us from these delusions that we are living, these fantasies that we are living. Ya Rabbul Alameen, we're shackled. Mullah Kareem, we're slaves. And we act as though our master is the shaitan, is the devil. Ya Allah, free us from these shackles. Ya Allah, we're drowning. Ya Allah, we're drowning in ignorance, in sins. In disobedience, Ya Allah, pull us out of this flood that we're drowning in. Ya ilaha la alameen, we don't even know what to ask for. Ya Allah, we're so uneducated, we don't know how to raise our hands. Ya Allah, our hearts are so hard, they don't tremble, they stop trembling, they stop weeping. Ya Allah, our eyes have stopped weeping. Ya Allah, teri kasam, we don't know what to ask for, how to ask, how to beg. Ya Allah, we're so confused. Mawla Kareem, you are Alim, you are the one to give us light, to show us the straight path. Ya Allah, no one can guide us. No one can guide us if you don't guide us. Ya Allah, we ask you for Hidayat. Ya Allah, the whole Ummah, please give Hidayat to all of the Ummah. Ya Allah, we ask, we constantly ask for you to guide our leaders. But Ya Allah, the truth is that we need guidance. The Awam, the civilians, the public, the Awam need guidance. Ya Allah, we need guidance more than anyone else. Amen. Ya Allah, save all Muslim countries from civil strife as well. Amen. Ya Allah, give us good leaders. Amen. Give us the tawfiq to know the difference between a good and bad leader. Amen. And for us to have the himmat and the sincerity and the courage to stand up for the truth, Amen. even when no one else is stood next to us. Amen. Ya Allah, give us the tawfiq to do the right thing, even when it means people are going to laugh at us. Amen. Ya Allah, when it means that people are going to do our best and they're going to embarrass us, may we have the courage for the sake of Imam Hussein in the land of Karbala. Ya Allah, make us strong, courageous Muslims. Ya Allah, save us from hypocrisy. Ya Allah, Khushamad, save us from flattery. Khushamadi or Munafikat, Munafik banne se hume mahfuz fama. Ya Allah, tu hi hume himmat adaf. Ya Allah, if you don't give us strength, we have no strength. If you don't give us sense, we have no sense. Ya Rabbul Alameen, please grant us what we've asked for. Grant us much more. Ya Allah, the things that we've not asked for, that we don't even know we need, but we do need. For our iman, Ya Allah, give us those things that we need for our iman, that we don't even know. Ya Allah, we don't have the sense. Ya Allah, make us... Follow in the footsteps of your beloved Mahbub Mustafa Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa Whatever brothers here have in their hearts, fulfill all of their lawful du'as and desires. Fulfill everyone's lawful. Ya Allah, whatever problems, Ya Allah, domestic problems, marital problems, brothers are having. Ya Allah, please solve and remove those problems for them. Ya Allah, husbands and wives who are not getting on, there's friction. Ya Allah, save their marriages from ending, save them from their marriages from reaching divorces. Ya Allah, give... Mother-in-laws, father-in-laws, 
brother-in-law, sister-in-laws the tawfiq to understand when to intervene and when not to intervene. Give families the tawfiq to know how to bring people together, how to bring husbands and wives together, not pull them apart. Ya Allah, this habit of ours of jealousy and arrogance and backbiting just to bring other people down, to give ourselves fake recognition. Ya Allah, this desire to be known, remove this desire from our hearts. Amen. Ya Allah, your naked awliya, the anbiya, they, did not, they were not desperate for fame. Save us from this greed of fame. Amen. Ya Allah, if no one knows us, if no one attends our janazah, if no one knows us in black men whilst we're alive, but Ya Allah, we have your pleasure, then we have succeeded. We have succeeded. Well, Akrim, this desire to be want, wanting to be famous and wanting to be known by everyone, wanting everyone to do salam to us, wanting izzat in the hearts of people, remove this desperate desire from our hearts. Amen. Ya Allah, fill our hearts with greed for good deeds and greed Amen. for sawab. Whatever we have asked for, please grant it to us, Ya Allah, and grant us even more. Whatever we have not been able to ask for and is better for us, please grant that to us. Also, Ya Allah, brothers who, uh, who do not have children but wish for children, Ya Allah, give them children as well. Amen. Ya Allah, brothers who wish for daughters, give them daughters. Amen. Brothers who wish for sons, give them sons. Amen. Ya Allah, there's brothers and sisters who, Ya Allah, are looking or waiting for rishte. Ya Allah, give them good spouses, Amen. good Sharif religious spouses. As well. Ya Allah, grandparents and our families the tawfiq to not delay marriages Amen. due to silly reasons such as not being in the same bradri. Ya Allah, grant parents and families the tawfiq to understand the importance of how important it is for them to marry these youngsters off. Ya Allah, save us, save our eyes from sins. Ya Allah, give us, help us in this jihad, this battle against ourselves. Ya Allah, we're weak, we can't fight the shaitan on our own. We can't even fight ourselves. Ya Allah, we can't fight ourselves if you don't help us. For the sake of your Habib sallallahu alayhi wa Ya Allah, forgive us on this night and grant us the tawfiq to mend our relationships with our parents, Amen. our brothers, sisters, our friends, our relatives. Ya Allah, if the relationships are broken, if they're weak, grant us the tawfiq to make them stronger and to fix those relationships as well. Allahumma inni asaluk al-afwa wa al-afiyata fi dunya wa al-akhirah. Allahumma barik lana fi sha'ban wa balikna ramadhan. Inna Allah wa malaikatahu yusalluna ala al-nabi. Ya ayuha al-ladhina amanu sallu alayhi wa sallimu taslima. As-salamu wa salamu wa salamu wa salamu wa salamu wa سبحان ربك رب العزة عما يصفون وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين
السلام عليكم يا رسول الله سبحانك اللهم وبحمدك لا اله الا انت استغفرك واتوب اليك سبحانك اللهم وبحمدك لا اله الا انت استغفرك واتوب اليك سبحانك اللهم وبحمدك لا اله الا انت استغفرك واتوب اليك يا رب العالمين شاو millions of billions of blessings upon the souls and the graves of all our deceased relatives especially those of us whose parents have passed away our brother Jamil his uh, elder brother passed away recently ya Allah shower uh, mercy upon his ruh as well forgive all our parents all our relatives all the brothers who've decided who've made niyat to give uh, to donate to Dawat Islami today to give sadaqah ya Allah give them ajr uh, many fold ya Allah many times more uh, than the sadaqah that they've given ya Allah give us all the tawfiq to be steadfast in our iman and grant us death in a state of iman ya Allah khatima bil iman khatima bil khair nasib farma wa sallallahu ta'ala ala habibihi sayyidina wa maulana muhammadin wa alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in